Why don't we introduce everybody? I'm Melina Matsikis. I'm the director, producer of this piece of Genius by Miss Lena Waite. We had like three people come in to test with Daniel. Jody was, I think, our favorite. Right. So she came in, and I remember he shrank in front of her. Like, he blushed. Everybody else, it was like he was overpowering them with his talent. What took you so long to respond to me? I sent you a very well-crafted message three weeks ago. I spell-checked it and everything and got crickets. Then today, out of the blue, you hit me up asking, asking if you want to grab dinner. What, like, what changed? They look great together. They elevated each other. She made him better as well as, you know, he did that as well for her. Yeah. And yeah. they became queen and slim. The words really flowed and it just worked. Put your hands on her head and get on the ground now. Are you serious? Get on the ground! Why is he under arrest? Get back in the car! I am an attorney! Damn, I'm just reaching for my cell phone! <laughs> black man to black woman, kill a self-defense and go on the run. Queen and Slim are two very different kinds of black people. They probably wouldn't have seen each other again had they not been forced together by the shared experience. Is this y'all? We have to go now. Please! It's not a film about turning the other cheek. It's a film about survival. Don't worry, you're safe here. To me, the templates were Malcolm X and Martin Luther King in terms of ideologies and ways of going through life. Let them go! But ultimately, Slim is Martin Luther King and Queen is Malcolm X, and by the end of the journey, they swap places. His value is his family and friends and home, and she doesn't have one. They really represent two different approaches to life. What do you want? I want to ride or die. We thought it was very important not to show black people as victims, to show that we survive and we fight and we fight back. Can I be your legacy? You already are.